Hi, I'm Jacques Pepin, and I'm cooking at home. I have about, not quite a pound of cabbage, white cabbage here, and I wanted to show you how to make full slow. You know, and you can, of course, cut you slow. What I'm doing like this, with a knife, it's a bit tedious, uh, or you can, of course, use one of those. Uh, and if you cut those, of course, make your life much easier. I have to remove the big stem here. And actually, if you don't even want to use that, you can use your regular grater. Its texture will be a, a little bit different, but frankly, it works work very well also. As you can see, the texture will be a bit finer, but it's okay too. How much do I have in there? So I have a good four cup of shredded cabbage, either red cabbage. Now I put carrot in it. When you peel your carrot, you cut both hands of it too, and you do it in one streak. You know, from here to there. Make sure that the carrot is higher than your finger, not this way. And one streak. That's it. And the carrot. Notice that I put my hand flat here, you know, because the tip of your finger, you're going to hurt yourself. Uh, I probably have enough with one carrot, a good half a cup to three quarters of a cup. I will make that in there, the carrot. I would say I'm going to put a good teaspoon Oh, yeah, the most, maybe, of sugar, or half a teaspoon of salt. To start with, I will season it, I will taste it after. About half a teaspoon of uh, Tabasco. Cider vinegar, at least one, maybe one and a half, one and a half tablespoon. I have probably half a cup of mayonnaise. And I like to put like a good tablespoon of cream in there, either sour cream or crème fraîche. Always taste it. Mm. Need salt. A little dash of salt again. Tabasco is okay. Okay. And of course in summer, for me, whether it's with a lobster roll or anything like that, I love coleslaw. I have a flower of the oregano outside. And here it is, my coleslaw. Bon appétit and happy cooking.